Hello, I'm Megan O'Leary. I often get asked by clients who are preparing to buy and sell about how to coordinate the two, with a common question being asked, should I buy or sell first? There are a few things to weigh up when considering this, and it may well depend on your own financial situation. Most people find that they have to be on the market and have an unconditional sale before they're in a position to offer on their next property, particularly if they're upsizing. So how can you coordinate settlement and allow enough time to find a new place? Even if you want to allow yourself up to a couple of months to find your next property, I find the best sale prices are still usually achieved within the first 30 days or so. So talk to me about preparing your home to really maximise the results in those first couple of weeks and get your finance pre-approved. So week one to three, you get the offer you've been hoping for. If you've been looking around for a home and haven't yet seen the one you love, try to negotiate a slightly longer settlement on your own contract, say 45 to 60 days. This way, you'll give yourself a few more weeks to really get out in the market and secure a home. If you have found the home you love, fantastic. You can move forward and try to match up the settlement dates. If your buying requirements are a little out of the ordinary, you may, for example, be looking for a home with city views within that five kilometer radius of the CBD, but room for a pony and stables. You really are looking for a unique property that may take a little bit longer to find. And if this is the case, you should probably have a chat to your finance broker about your ability to purchase first and then sell. Again, talk to me about preparing your home for sale so that when that right one comes along, you're in a position to move quickly and minimise the time before you achieve a successful sale on your current home. When is the best time to sell? This is another question I'm often asked. Apart from a few weeks over Christmas and a couple of weeks at Easter, I've found the market over the past couple of years to be consistent throughout the year. September to November are traditionally busier than other times of the year, with more properties on the market. However, if you're purchasing, you'll need to keep in mind that naturally there's also more buyer competition during this time. I hope these tips have been helpful. If you're considering selling and would like to meet for an initial chat, or if you're ready to go now, please give me a call to arrange for me to pop out and have a chat with you. An appraisal of your home is complimentary no matter what stage you are currently. I look forward to hearing from you and helping you achieve a smooth transition into your next home.